Welcome to our quick guide on utilizing shift mode in Rewazd. Enhance your gaming by creating dynamic control layers. Start by launching Rewazd and selecting your device from the bottom left panel. Create a new profile by clicking the plus icon. Name it according to your preference. Select the button you wish to use as a shift modifier. Then choose shift mode from the mapping options. Jump to shift lets you select the layer to activate. Mode sets how the shift behaves. Hold for press and hold activation. Toggle for on-off toggling. And custom for advanced configurations. Delay before jump introduces a pause before the shift activates. In this example, we've set the magnifier to activate when you press to the right mouse button. As you can see, aiming itself works fine. But the moment you open the inventory, the magnifier starts causing serious interference. By using shift layers, you can configure the magnifier so it doesn't trigger while the inventory is displayed. Group the keyboard with the mouse. Go back to the profile. Add a key that opens the inventory. Select another shift layer. And set it to activate on hold or toggle depending on how the game opens the inventory. Switch to the layer to which we assign the inventory button. If your game lets you close the inventory with a different button, be sure to add an exit from the extra layer for that button. Now go to the mouse settings. And set do not inherit so that the main layer settings are not applied to this layer. Click apply to save the configuration and test it to make sure shift mode works as intended. As you can see, the magnifier no longer interferes with using the inventory.